On Sky News at 6, Alexander McQueen, the darling of British fashion, has been found dead after apparently committing suicide. Paramedics were called to the designer's London home this morning, but he was pronounced dead at the scene. Police say his death's not being treated as suspicious. He emerged on the scene as the bad boy of British fashion, but Alexander McQueen died an icon. An inspirational designer who helped transform the UK fashion industry and made his name with the world's biggest labels. The 40-year-old, whose real name was Lee, was found dead after apparently committing suicide at his home. His website was quickly closed down. Then a simple message emerged from his design company announcing his death, adding... At this stage, it is inappropriate to comment on this tragic news beyond saying that we are devastated and are sharing a sense of shock and grief with Lee's family. Only last week, the designer revealed to fans via his Twitter site that his mother had passed away the day before. He was also known to have been deeply affected by the death of fashion director Isabella Blow in 2007, the woman credited with having discovered him at the St Martin's Graduate Show in 1994. Within two years, he was working at Givenchy. After that, he moved to Gucci, always maintaining his reputation for controversy. The most important thing to him um, was the, the shock value on society of actually making statements, some of which were religious, some of which were political. Um, he was this strange combination of sort of intellect and manufacturing capability. And, the whole thing for him was about his show. Uh, it wasn't about commercialism. Alexander McQueen has always attracted the top names in fashion to model for him, among them Kate Moss and Jodie Kidd. His talent earned him the title of British Designer of the Year on four occasions. He was also awarded the CBE. His vision was astounding, um, bizarre at times, sometimes deeply unsettling. Um, but he kind of knew, knew about, he knew no boundaries. Um, whatever it took, he would do in order to um, create the vision that he saw. Alexander McQueen began his career as a 16-year-old at a Savile Row tailor's. No one could have told them what an influence he would go on to have on global fashion. A man described after his death by the industry's greatest names as quite simply a genius. Emma Birchley, Sky News. Simon Newton is outside the designer's house in central London. Uh, his body removed from there only an hour or so ago, Simon, uh, as, as the world starts to react to his death. Yes, it was a very sombre scene here at about uh, half past four this afternoon as this private ambulance arrived to take away Alexander McQueen's uh, body. Uh, nearby on the pavement was actually his partner who'd come to uh, uh, visit uh, his apartment in this mansion block behind me. He lived on the, one of the upper floors here. This is where his body was found this morning. Uh, his partner went in for a short period of time, then came out and stood uh, clearly distressed uh, on the pavement as the body was brought out and put into this uh, private ambulance. As you say, his influence and impact on British fashion it was, was extremely uh, great. Uh, a son of a taxi driver from Hackney who was left school at 16 and became a pattern cutter in Savile Row, then went to Central St Martin's School of Fashion, was spotted by Isabella Blow, and uh, from there it was uh, a meteoric rise for fashion, uh, British uh, Designer of the Year awards, as Emma said there uh, in her piece, uh, and a great loss uh, to British fashion. Um of course, it's at the beginning of the fashion season and uh, he was expected to roll out his new collections in Europe and in the United States. Well, he was due to unveil his collection in Paris next month. Uh, he was not due to appear at London Fashion Week, but that is obviously due to start very soon. So, as you say, the fashion industry gearing up for a very busy period of time. His shows, his lavish, very unconventional shows, if you like, was something that people obviously waited uh, to see at, uh, at, at Fashion Week and other great uh, events like that. So always usually towards the end of the, uh, of the event, something people stayed and wanted to, uh, to definitely see. His, his collections, uh, if you remember, the famous bumps the trousers and the, uh, the unconventional clothes that he did design. His impact was, was huge. Great tributes this evening to him from other designers. Catherine Hamnett describing him as a genius. Vivian Westwood saying how sorry she is to have 
heard about his death, particularly uh, at such a young age, and he was really in his prime at the moment, uh, and they feel he had so much more to offer. Simon, thank you very much. Simon Newton reporting. A man